Hello everyone and welcome back to Know How. Today we have an exciting tutorial lined up for you. We will be showing you how to create a search box in spreadsheet using conditional formatting. This simple yet powerful technique can greatly enhance your data management and organization skills. Today's video is especially important for those friends who are dealing with big data and they have to search certain entries from it on a regular basis. This simple method will make this process easy for them. So don't skip this video and watch it till end. Don't forget to subscribe now how and press the bell icon for more videos. Before starting the process, let's first understand the syntax of this formula. The syntax consists of search bracket start find text comma within text comma and then start number and then close the bracket find text is actually the text or value that you want to find within the data within text this is the text or cell range where you want to search from the find text start number this is an optional argument that specifies the position within the text if omitted, the search starts to the first character. This is the data that we are going to use to make the search using conditional formatting. The data consists of the serial number, employee name, item, rate, quantity and amount. The first step is to select the data and while selecting the data, make sure that you do not select the headers of the columns then you have to go to the home tab and under the home tab we have the conditional formatting then you have to select the new rule when you click it new formatting rule window open this window provide you different formatting options you will select the last option that is use a formula to determine which cell to format when you click it it will ask you to write formula over here i will write equal search bracket start and then i will select the cell where i wanted to write my keyword so i will select this cell then i will write comma and after this i will select the cell under the serial number then i will lock it by pressing f4 two times after this i will write the end sign and then select the cell under the employee name lock it by pressing f4 two times and then again end sign and now the cell under the item lock it by pressing f4 two times and then again end sign and similarly the cells under the rate quantity and amount is also selected locked and separated with the help of and sign after this bracket is closed then i will press the format when i press the format format cell window opens here i will go to the fill and then choose the color that i like and then press ok and again i will press ok so now if i write laptop in the search box and press enter you can see that only the laptop is highlighted with this color so if i want to search the keyboard i will write the keyboard so you can see that the data about the keyboard is highlighted with the color so what if if you want to remove all this formatting from your table for this purpose select your table go to the home tab click the conditional formatting now click the clear rule and under the clear rule you will select the clear rule from the selected cells so your original data is packed and all formatting have been removed from your table and there you have it you have successfully created a search box in your spreadsheet using conditional formatting this technique can be incredibly helpful when dealing with large data sets or when you need to quickly locate specific information we hope you found this tutorial useful and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more helpful tips and tricks thanks for watching and we'll see you next time